But right now, I want you to meet Zarina and Belson, both professional roller skaters. Belson took one look at Zarina and knew exactly what he had to do, and that was to get back into training just to meet Zarina. She was having a lesson doing lift work, which is what we do with Dodger lift work. And she was very graceful in the air, very, very pretty woman. Somebody said he used to skate, and he'd been out of it for a while. And they said, he, this guy can skate. And all I'm thinking is, it's a body, and I can climb on it. He says, do you want to do wild things with my body? And I, I looked at him. And within 10 minutes, I was climbing all over it. <laughs> and my skates on walked out, and as I was leaving with my friend, I said, you know, I think I may come back to roller skating. I said, but if I do, that's my next partner right there. We and were rehearsing one day. And he was being real pissy. <laughs> he was giving me a bad time. And I'm going, what is wrong with you? You know, what is it? I've said something. I've done something. What is wrong? And he said, well, it's just hard. I said, what is hard? He said, being around you. I said, what do you mean? Am I being, am I on PMS? What, what is the problem here? And he says, no. I feel said, really different inside. I feel different about you. And it's something that you do to me. And I feel comfort. I feel warm. Well, gee, um, this is really, you know, kind of odd because he's never never asked for a date, never come on to me, never got out of the way, never anything, right? So then that intrigued me a little, and so I started, I started pursuing the relationship. And all of a sudden, I was like lending my hand or uh, arm, uh, uh, arm around her shoulders, you know, a uh, small kiss on the cheek or something, which in, in turn, she started to realize that, yes, he must be feeling something because he never did this before. Um, she, all I knew is I wanted him, <laughs> and uh, I was going to get him. And she, when she danced, she's got very graceful arms, very ballet arms. And uh, I used to call her my butterfly. And if we perform together, and especially if it's a song that's special to us, and there'll be that moment where we'll look at each other, and we know. And caressing and the holding. We had a lot of cuddles and layouts and stuff. And it was we, I do one of these things and look right in his eyes, and it was just, it was there. And that was kind of, that's cool. Yeah. The yeah. tenderness that goes with it. That was really, really nice. And that, I think that's one of the moments that I recall right offhand when it was really just beautiful. And I mean, if I would have had to chase him to the ends of the earth, I knew this is the one I had to have. And like I say, I'm a stubborn person, and I never showed, I am seldom ever show emotions in anything. And she had seen that part of me. And um, well, all he was a real deep person, so he never talked much about himself. And it intrigued me a little bit, because I'm one of those kind of people that if I get to know you and love you as a person, I'm in your life. You either I like being with you. I enjoy being with you. I like going with you and stuff. But to say I love you, I th was the whole problem. I'm pouring out all this love and adoration, and he's doing Jack Diddley here. And when I say it, it's going to be a commitment, and that's how I really feel, you know, and I said a bond, a join. Mm -hmm. It wasn't easy. I set him down on a park bench, and I said, look, I said, I, you know, I need to know here because I have feelings for you, and I'm falling in love with you, and I need to know how you feel about it. So that I love you, you know, and it was... And I I'm saying, well, if you feel that way, then... What do something. He said, what do you want me to do? Write it on the wall? They said, well, for the opener, it's okay. So he got a can of spray paint. <laughs> uh, we were driving the car, and he jumped out, of, jumped out of the car in the middle of a, an intersection, and he wrote, I love you, Zarina, in the middle of the street, <laughs> spray paint. And so when I said it, I think it was finally a statement that was made that she realized, boy, I think he really does love me, <laughs> you know? He's put My it. book, I mean, I don't sleep around or any of this kind of thing, so, you know, to me, when you love somebody, the next step is and he said would you would you really marry me he didn't ask me would you and i said well yeah i would but then it was left again we dropped the subject again i mean i was about to kill him i had already talked to a couple of the people that i was going to ask you to marry me in the roller rink and we, uh, we walked in the roller rink and he was in cahoots with somebody in there and they had a cake baked and he proposed to me in front of the entire roller rink the great big ring and everything and i, I and it was like everybody went yeah and she was like oh. Total shock, you know, like, whoa, you know. Now yeah, I got him. I mean, he did do it. 